What's up, YouTube? This is your boy Shino. Well, go back in here like about now. It's popping though. Today we have a UU battle. This is a UU battle that I had against my friend uh, Segalizer. That is his Twitch name, but uh, he goes by Blaze um, in this in game. So, without further ado, let's get into today's UU battle. It was a pretty decent one. I think you guys would really enjoy this one. Uh, it was a really good UU battle between me and him. There were some great plays made by both of us. Um, honestly, there's a lot of moments in this battle where it's just gonna be like, okay, some shit it was just like obvious it was gonna happen, but you know, all in all, still a good battle. So right at the back, he's gonna lead with a snow legs. I'm gonna lead with my son Goku, aka Damanatan. Oh, superpower coming through. Look how my superpower did. That is going to do so much damage. That thing is gonna be so obliterating. It's just ridiculous. At some point in time, that thing just becomes the ultimate threat, and it's really ridiculous. So um Darmanitan is just power like I don't understand why people sleep on it Son Goku's is gonna super power again I mean my attack and my defense is failing but hey the Snorlax is out of my way nine out of ten this could have been a soul vested curse Snorlax um that would have been a very big problem because you know if they run stuff like that then all in all shit gets really crazy and hectic so that that's like mad crazy so now he's gonna switch out to his Milotic Milotic is something I'm not too worried about Milotic is just one of those Pokemon that's just there and I'm just looking at it like yo who cares what you gonna do use your ice beam because at the end of the day Shaman can eat it up look at Shaman eat it up oh my gosh Shaman ate that up so nicely and I'm thinking to myself okay now it's time for the young sleeve flip because I don't expect him to switch out I think he's just gonna think he's gonna outspeed and just go for the complete work but guess what hex is a thing Ah, this is one of those moments in Pokemon where you always just get upset because Hex really mattered. I and mean, it's just like, I have a lot of battles like that. I don't know why, I just do. So now I'm going to go out into my Assault Vested Gudra. My Assault Vested Gudra pretty much eats up any Ice Beam hits that he has to deal with. So I'm going to use T-Bolt. And it's going to do a decent amount of damage. See, look at the Ice Beam. Look at that. Look at that. Just eating that shit up. That shit looks so good. Oh my god. That's so, this man just had an ice cream sandwich or some shit. Like, what? He's just Ice Beam. That ain't do nothing. Not a zip de Niro. So now we're going for another T ball on my loading. My loading is dead. Oh, next turn. Next turn. I said it's dead, but it's pretty much dead. Look at his hope. Like, what the fuck can he do? Like, what? It's like no saving this bitch. This bitch is gone. It's finito. It's over. It's like bye bye. Get out. Get out. You no stay in my restaurant anymore. You leave. Oh, my doggy is getting jealous. But uh, the T ball is coming through. It is really, really gonna finish off this my loading, which is great for me. Um, I'm kind of glad it's gone, but now he's going to go into his Gudra itself, so I'm pretty sure his Gudra is a soul vested as well. The difference between his Gudra and my Gudra is one shiny, one dragon. His name is Fresh, my name is Slime. So it's popping fresh with popping slime. So Dragon Pulse with Dragon Pulse. This is like trading blows. This is just Dragon Pulse and then Dragon Pulse back and forth. This is like, dude, are we seriously sitting here trading Dragon Pulses like this? Like, I just seen some stuff in a lot of battles, but people trading blows between the same move, between the same two Pokemon. It's hilarious. Like, look at that. Gudra versus is Gudra. Like, who expects shit like this? Nobody. You never expect anything like this. This is hilarious, fam. <laughs> I, I thought that shit was so funny. Like, I don't know why. But now I'm gonna go into Son Goku because Son Goku is legit that nigga. Um, it really doesn't matter who you switch out into. It's gonna get hit hard. It's gonna get hard as a motherfucker. So now he's gonna go into Tentacruel and I'm gonna U-turn because I expected him to go in there. He's expecting a Flare Blitz or something like that. So I was just like, yo... Nah, bruh. Nah, bruh. It ain't even working like that. I was like, oh, don't do it. Please don't do it. But a lot of people always question why I go into Big Bumble or Tentacruel or some shit. I know for a fact it can live one special attack and move. Like, I know for a fact it can live one unless it's like Giga Drain or something from a Pokemon with high special attack. Like, Tentacruel doesn't have that much of a high special attack. It's a decent special attack, but it's not high. So, you know, I'm not too worried about the Skull. Plus, I knew he was going to go for Toxic because he wanted to get rid of this wall. So, now the Earthquake is going to come through. And guess what? Earthquake does so much damage. Oh, my God. The damage is just unreal. Look at that Earthquake. Oh, my God. Just like... Only if it would have been a little bit more. If I would have had a few more attack EVs, that thing would have been dead. That would have been absolutely finito. Like, come on. Bye. Adio a la la vista. I, I can't even talk. <laughs> so, now that uh, Grass Patch is going to come back in here, um, he's pretty much just trying to see what I'm going to do at this point. Because I knew he's going to Skull. Like, the Skull is, like, it's predictable. Like, I'm poisoned. Plus, you think I'm going to just sit in and get Skull. And you're just going to, I'm just let you get buffed by sand. Like, I, I really don't care about you Skulling too much. But it's like, even though he's buffing, he's getting whatever he loses back in Black Sludge. So, it's just still at the point where it's just like, come on, man. Are you serious? It's like, Kimmy, Kimmy, what you doing? What you doing, Kimmy? Kimmy, 
Timmy, Timmy. So he's gonna go for protect. Um, pretty much protect just to see what uh, what type of move I'm gonna go for here. And it's just like, okay, I went for Earth Power. So now I expected him to switch out. You know, maybe if he wanted to preserve this thing, just to have it as a late game Pokemon or some type of father. I have no idea what he can possibly do with this Tentacruel at this point because it's pretty much dead. Like, let's just let's be honest. Once once a Pokemon gets that low, unless it has some hella recovery moves. It's dead. It's like nothing else it can do. So now the sub, the sun is gonna subside, and not not the sun, the sand. I'm sorry. Why did I say sun? Sand, sun, sand, sun. Almost like Samsung, but Samsung. You need to think about this way too much, you know. So I'm gonna go for Earth Power here and finish off this young Tentacruel. Tentacruel, I apologize, but you gotta get out of here. Like, be gone. Au revoir. Like, underly, underly. Skedaddle. Be gone. Just bye. So Tentacruel's dead as fuck. Um. That's pretty funny to me because the Tentacruel really didn't do as too much as it, you know you think it would do. So now he's gonna go into Fresh, aka this fat ass Gudra. I'm gonna use Dazzling Gleam when I should have just went for like a Seed Flare or some shit. He's gonna live with like bare health, and I'm thinking to myself, okay. So I just openly invited this man to Sludge Wave the fuck out of me. Thanks, you know, way to go, bro. It's like the smartest decision I ever seen you do in like a thousand years. No, okay. Um, so now we're gonna go into Poor Guy Z, and guess what? The download takes effect for my attack rose, which is pretty much useless. Now, if I would've got like an attack, uh, like my special defense would've rose, that'd've been great, you know? Not my special defense, my special attack, if that shit would've rose, that'd've been great, but it didn't. So it's just like, okay, it's like what? It's like, what am I doing? So now he's gonna go into his Heracross, which is Scarf Heracross. Um, he's running a Scarf Moxie Heracross, like, that's OG, like, that's OG. I haven't seen that in like a while. Like, I know people still use it, but the fact that I haven't seen it since like 5th gen, this is just scary as fuck. Because I honestly I used to run this thing a lot. I used to run that our expert belt, you know, and just go ham with it. But now it's like people using it against me, so it's just like. So now I'm gonna go for Flare Blitz because I know I'm out of speed. Obviously, you know, this nigga out of speeds regardless. Hold this motherfucker, Flare Blitz. Hair cross. Your hair never cross my field and it was just like you know what let's go go back in here like a bono he's gonna sit on his inferno so at this point i'm pretty much trolling yup like throughout this battle i'm pretty much trolling uh and it's just like flare blitz like who uses flare blitz on another fire type to be funny like who does that i do i do I do. <laughs> that shit is so fucked up, son. I'm going to hell for this one. But legit, he's going to get damage from the recoil, and I'm out of speed, and then I'm going to flare blitz again, and plus his health is already at, like, bare minimum. I don't think I'm going to take that much damage to die, so, yeah. Your freedom just got rock with your pink ass. Look like you've been playing it some pink putty, boy. You need to stop playing that hair dye. Get your shit together. But yeah, so... That's a GG. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Go ahead and smash that like button. I apologize if it's not as hype as my usual commentaries because I'm still getting to the midst of things because, you know, I haven't really did a post battle in a while. So, yeah. Go ahead and leave a like. And if you want to become a member of the channel, so I'm going to hit and subscribe. And with that being said, my name is Shino Noir. I'll go back and you're like a ball in the old PC in the Middle East. Don't forget to be your guns because I will blaze it up.